Hello out there in YouTube land, this is Craig S1996 Television here, and it's now time for me to do another one of my Super Mario All-Stars game reviews. This time I'm going to do the Lost Souls version, and I'm only uh, going to play until I, uh, my late, all my lives reach down to zero, so here we go. I'm deciding not to play on my Emerson TV this time. Luigi game. Thank you. The only thing I had I hate about the Super Mario All Stars though is because the uh, movement in this game is a little bit too fast. Some luck came out of nowhere, I guess. All right, five thousand. Here we go. Two hundred. Hey. Why is that this thing won't let me go? One. I'm out of time here. Hold on. I'm gonna have to start this over. Hold on for a second, you guys. And you gotta just, like start the game over. Please game, please. There we go. I couldn't get past because I was just so big. And because of the FC twin controllers being all faulty with me. But here we go, we gotta stay up on the top here. Five thousand. I gotta wait for that again. Okay. 
Okay. Here goes nothing. Five thousand. Here's the first Bowser Castle. Castle. All right. That's the first toad saved. This is the Lost Levels uh, version of Super Mario World. Super Mario Brothers, by the way. think there was going to be any way I could get past that.
Oh, whatever. I don't know what was in, I don't, didn't know what was in there anyway. Nothing. Yeah, no way I could have caught that. At least we catch a checkpoint. Damn it. So, excuse me. I'm sorry. One last time to make that jump. And there we go. Well, like I said before, this is just a, uh, this is just a gameplay, uh, this is just a, uh, just a game review of me playing Super Mario Brothers: The Lost Levels. I mean, it's not a full run or anything, but I made it up to World 2 of 2. That's not as far as I got in the Mario Brothers game, unfortunately. But, I guess I'll see you all next time for my next video.